Hi everybody, my name is Alex and welcome back to Murphy Bed Studios. In today's video, it's gonna be kind of short, but we're gonna do an experiment. In today's video, I wanna show you the difference between particle board and furniture grade plywood core. All of our products, especially our Manhattan collection, is all made out of furniture grade plywood. And I wanna show you the difference about the strength and the pros and cons about both of the products. Let's get into it. So a lot of the products on the market today that are kind of like the lower cost of a Murphy bed are all, or majority of them, are all made out of particle board. And particle board is really compressed wood with a lot of glue in it. The problem with this is it doesn't have a lot of strength. And so here at Murphy Bed Studios, even our least expensive bed, which is the Manhattan Collection, we build that product out of furniture grade plywood. And as you can see closely, it is layered plywood core. So the difference between the two are that this is a lot stronger and a lot more durable, and it will last you a lot longer. While this is a cheaper product, to buy, it is just not the greatest product for the long term. So if you want a quality product, you really want to get a plywood core in your build. Whether you do it yourself or you buy it from somebody else, just make sure that you're getting the plywood core. And I'm going to demonstrate a little bit about the difference in both of these products. We're going to do a drop hammer test is what I call it. And you'll see the difference between the strength of both. We're also gonna show you how these products react to water in a 12 hour period. Problem with particle board is it doesn't do really well with water. So if you dip this in water, this is gonna swell up within an hour, if not less than that. While the plywood core really acts differently, it doesn't quite swell up as much as this one. It does, I mean, wood is wood, and it's gonna do that regardless, but not as much as this one. If this gets into water, I mean, your product is junk. We're gonna dip them in water. We're gonna do some measurements. So stick around to the end of the video to, to see the results of that. Okay, guys, this is the moment that you guys all been waiting for. We are going to use a four pound sledgehammer. The hammer is gonna travel approximately five feet. This is actually the particle board. This is the product that we don't use, and this is the product that we use. I'm also gonna demonstrate our painted product, which is also plywood core, usually either nutty alder, maple, birch, or oak. So guys, I hope you like that. I wanna show you what the outcome is. So guys, as you can see, this is particle board, which is, in my opinion, not good quality. We use plywood core in all of our product. As you can see, this made a little bit of a dent, but it did not break it. It's a long lasting product. So guys, I hope you've seen the difference between the two different types of products. And when it comes to buying a Murphy bed, just make the right choice. Don't go with something cheap because you saved a few hundred dollars. Spend a little bit more money, but you'll get a product that will last you a lifetime. Guys, we're gonna do a water test like I told you. These are both three quarter inch thick uh, plywood. One being our furniture grade plywood core and of course the particle board. We are gonna let it sit in this bowl of water for 12 hours and we'll show you the results. So if you guys are in the market of buying a Murphy bed, definitely check us out, click the link below, go to our website and you can purchase one of our products there. All right guys, so we're back at our samples. It's been about 24 hours or so, and we're gonna pull them out of the water and kind of show you what they actually did. All right, I already noticed and can see a significant difference. Do you guys see that right there? As you guys can see, <laughs> that the particle board is just junk. So now we're gonna measure the uh, plywood core product, the one that we build out of. I can see that it did vary a little bit. It, it did take up just a little bit of water, but definitely not as much as the particle board. At the very edge, we have 17.7 millimeters, 
and at the very edge we have 18.8 so one millimeter is what it changed in a 24 hour span on the next one on the particle board we have original size at 19.5 and the submerged side is 23.14 so 23.10 basically so that is a significant difference that is a, almost a five millimeter difference uh, between the original thickness and the submerged version so really product that is made out of furniture grade plywood uh, will not be as damaged as your particle board which you could still reuse once it gets aired out and dried out while this this is junk what it's going to start doing once it dries up is starts flaking out and the strength of it is completely gone so guys when you go and you shop for a furniture or our Murphy beds or any other Murphy beds, definitely consider your hard earned money and where you wanna spend it. If you wanna save a few hundred dollars, yeah, okay, you're gonna go with particle board, but you're gonna see the results and I think you'll be disappointed with it. So definitely spend a little bit more money, get a good product, and I think you'll be happy for a very long time. Guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe to our channel for our future videos. Click that like button. And you can also uh, find us on our Facebook, Instagram, and of course our website. Thank you for watching and have a blessed day.